what up guys welcome to a quick tutorial uh, how to filter fade in automation your track in machine 2.12 I'm running on Windows let me play the track just to uh, see what I'm talking about this is heat you got M on the beat so I'm uh, running a low pass filter on the master just to give you the effect of um, walking to a club getting closer to the door Place. so uh, let me show you how I've done it it worked for me hopefully it will work for you as well so you can't really add an effect to the main master uh, bus on, on machine so what I've done is I've created a new group and then within that group I've added the uh, faulty effect so let me just delete that okay so um, create a new group I've got my um, my drums, my bass, and a couple of instruments in there as well. So create a new group, just label it, filter, fade in. Okay, and go to your group, select the filter in here, which is over there. Okay, so uh, on your first scene, I'm gonna just bring that here just to loop from uh, 1 to 9 double click create a new pattern okay make sure that your master selected in the group here okay and uh, what you want to do is uh, you know first find the frequency for the low pass filter this is heat you got okay. him on the beat so you can see that nothing's affected now so in order to get that going go to your mixer and all these channels make sure you select your group that you created so the filter fading group um, if you don't select it it means that uh, the filter won't take effect for that channel so what I'll do is just my um, voice tag I'll, I won't use the filter on that the rest I'll use the low pass filter so now this is heat you got M on the beat we can play around with the frequency just to find the right one so probably around here maybe 197 hertz okay so with your uh, mouse if you select the gray area and you click once I start to play back and move the mouse cursor to the right the automation will begin so let's do it this is heat you got M on the beat so you can see my automation taking place okay so move it to the right slowly and as you get closer to the end this is heat okay. You got M on the B. Now the one thing with machine is if I uh, expand my loop going to the next scene it doesn't seem to carry on the um, sort of the high pass uh, frequency it goes back to where we first begin. So let me This play is with heat. You. you got M on the B. So this is our automation. Pulling up to the top. And then it seems to go back to the low pass uh, hertz 197. So the work around that is a little bit tricky but can be done. So select your scene, your next scene. Double click to create a new pattern. And at the bottom you can see the uh, original hertz that was done so what you do is take the pencil tool and just in the beginning drag it all the way up and that's it but now in order to take effect for the whole track you've got to go to your next scene double click create a new pattern 
and again with the pencil tool just select it and move it all the way up to 12.5 hertz so now we've got it working so it's pretty easy created a new um, group go to your mixer you choose over here your filter fading group make sure that this is selected to master you can also automate the uh, volume to kind of fade in the volume but I'm just going to leave it for the low pass filter and then you choose your frequency and you automate it to the right so this is heat you got M on the beat that's pretty much it pretty quick and simple it worked for me hopefully it will work for you as well so like I said automate to the right go to your next scene create a new pattern push up the heads all the way up 